Today's episode can be yours for three easy payments of $19.99. Well, let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. We're going on tour this summer, and if you want to see us play live, you better. And I'm the one that plays guitar, man. You better watch. I better play watch. the air acoustic <laughs> guitar, man. You I'm really good at that. Act fast, because all the shows are nearly sold out. Yeah, we're going to be in Las Vegas, Nevada, Salt Lake City, Utah, Denver, Colorado, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, Indianapolis, Indiana, Detroit, Michigan, Omaha, Nebraska, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Uh, tell your friends and get your tickets while they last at rhettandlinklive.com. Yes. Now, with everybody cutting their cords these days, and I'm not talking about the umbilical, I'm talking that about happens. The, the cable cords. That also happens. One of the things that we've lost and all the convenience that we've gained, we have lost the art of the infomercial. I miss the infomercial. Well, you're in luck, buddy, because you're about to watch a bunch of them. It's time for these infomercials be cheesy, but guessing what they're selling won't be easy. Okay, so infomercials out of context? Okay, here's what I'm going to do, Link. Uh, no, not exactly. I'm going to... Uh, play a little bit of a ridiculous infomercial. Like out of context. Uh, well, I'm gonna just play just enough so you don't figure out what the context is. Okay. So kind of halfway in context. So devoid of context. And then okay. I'm going to uh, uh, give you some multiple choices as to what the actual product is that's being sold. Yeah, Are you yeah, bored? You're going, you're going, you're going to sleep. <laughs> want, until you show me an infomercial, I always, I'm always falling asleep when I watch infomercials. If you get three or more wrong, you have to drink out of the Champagne ShamWow, which is a ShamWow soaked in champagne. And if you get okay. three uh, more than that right, <laughs> then I have to drink out of the champagne. Sham wow. Are you ready for your first infomercial? Yeah, man. Let's watch it. Hot dogs. They're as American as baseball and apple pie. But what makes a hot dog more than just a hot dog? <laughs> oh, what you what like makes to know? a hot dog more than just a hot dog? What is it, Link? Is it A, the Frank filler, a tube that injects the condiment of your choice into the middle of your hot dog? Ooh. B, the Happy Hot Dog Man, a plastic contraption that turns your hot dog into a human-like figure? No. C, the Puppy Press, a custom panini press that turns your bun into the shape of an adorable dog. Or D, the Hot Dad, a hot dog that will cheer you on at your next Little League game. <laughs> and I bet he'd show up every time too, wouldn't he? <laughs> My dad did, your dad didn't? No, he didn't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> C is possible, but like, you know, why you gotta make me spell it out, dude? Uh, That's my kind of humor. I'm, I'm hoping Honesty. It's Frank Filler, A. All right, let's see the rest of the commercial. But what makes a hot dog more than just a hot dog? Introducing the Happy Hot Dog Man. It brings ordinary hot dogs to life, making lunchtime more fun. Just put your hot dog into the Happy Hot Dog Man and close the lids. The Happy Hot Dog Man makes a happy imprint on your hot dog. It's like a toy you can eat. It's like a toy you can eat, Mom. It's like a way that I'm allowed to slice hot dogs because I can't use knives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I need this, but I don't want it. Well, the interesting thing I is- a, I want a Frankfurter filler. The interesting thing is that's the same tool that the doctor used when he gave us the vasectomies. <laughs> right, just your <laughs> lamp <laughs> Oh, it's a little man. <laughs> <laughs> I can't make babies anymore, <laughs> but I can have fun. <laughs> <laughs> let's, watch, let's watch the next one. Whoa, got another one here. <laughs> hey. oh, whoa, whoa, get the net. There he is. Got it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Come on now. I, you know what, I'm, I'm getting cable now yes. again. Uh, what is, you know what, there should be a show, a streaming show on Netflix. Yes, that's what I was thinking. That's just, just this stuff. I'd, I'd pay for it. <laughs> what was this an that. infomercial for, Link? A, the rubber dub glove, a steel coated glove that can descale a whole fish with one swipe. Cool. B, the fish magnet, a vibrating light emitting pole that attracts fish when placed in the water. C, the wonder boner, a steel rod that removes all of a fish's bones by impalement. Or D, a lawyer who specializes in boating under the influence cases. <laughs> Cause that's definitely what happened in. Okay, so C wasn't the joke. <laughs> no, believe it or not. Uh, fish magnet. This is when you say that's what they call you in high school. No, okay. Yeah. You're not gonna go for it? No. Okay. Uh, I think <laughs> Wonder Boner. Rub a dub glove, because once fell swipe, you're just cleaning the fish. Let's watch it. 
Just wait till you see what I've got. It's the Wonder Boner. You take the fish, you find the top of the spine, and you slide him through the ring on the Wonder Boner, and... Voila! The Wonder Boner. My wife would like that. <laughs> mm. <laughs> okay, all right, Blue so they, they know what's going on, or at least that one guy does. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think it's great? I think it's great. Nope. Now, but here, I think they're in on the joke, that's what okay, I'm saying. Well, here's the thing. The Wonder Boner, I mean, the joke kind of writes itself, and so I, I wasn't gonna make a joke, but it's actually true that that was my nickname in high school. <laughs> oh, I was trying to give it to Fish Magnet. <laughs> That's what I was whispering about, if you didn't know. Okay, let's watch the next one. Nowhere to run, nowhere to ride. Oh, but didn't give you much. Nowhere to run, nowhere to ride. Nowhere to run, nowhere to ride. Now that's not rain, that was a sprinkler. I could tell from the angle of the water. Maybe it's really windy. What's the infomercial for, Link? Is it A, fun slides, strips of plastic that strap to your feet so you can skate on the carpet. B, the bed bike. Fun wheels that you put on the bed to turn it into a stationary bicycle. C, hip zip hooray! An indoor zip line with rubber posts for safety. Or D, a new identity after you accidentally call your teacher mom. <laughs> <laughs> you done it, man. I did it multiple times. Yeah, and you, you wanna get out of there. Witness protect act yeah, happening. Right. <laughs> Are you telling me B, bed bike is a bed turned into a bike? Yep. Okay. A stationary bike. Oh, a stationary bike. Mm -hmm. um, zip lines, there's no way that can be possible. Fun slides, mm, mm. I think is it. A. Let's watch it. Nowhere to ride? Now wherever there's carpet, blast off with fun slides. Fun slides bring the good times inside. You don't have to be a pro, just strap them on and go, go, go. More fun than socks on a polished wood floor, fun slides let you slide on carpet. Carpet! Yeah, my little, little on carpet. On carpet. If you don't already want to kill your kids, <laughs> <laughs> get them fun slides. <laughs> if, you, if you don't already, because that's the objective <laughs> parenting. Right. Yeah. That's the premise of your job. Try not to kill them. <laughs> Father of the year. <laughs> okay. Uh, hey, how am I doing, by the way? Oh, you got one out of three. Oh, here we go, here's another one. Robes are heavy and hot, and towels with fasteners? I think not. Wow, that's quite a freeze frame you got there. Mm-hmm. Okay, I didn't hear what they said because I was just looking at if towels, the towel was Towels fall. are heavy. That's not what they said. They yeah, didn't it say was. towels are heavy. Towels are heavy and hot. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what is this for, Link? Is it the wearable towel, a towel with armholes? B, the micro wrap, a heated onesie that you warm up in the microwave before wearing. Mm. C, pajamas, with an exclamation point. Pajamas? Uh, yeah, with a Z and an exclamation point. That's terry cloth PJs that zip apart at the torso for multiple drying options. Or D, the low blow, a giant blow dryer for your no-no parts. Ooh, I already have one of those. Yeah, it's just a blow dryer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Every morning. Um, you think I'm lying? Not very efficient. Ask my neighbors, because I leave the windows shades up. Um, the wearable town. All of these sound like the same thing, A, B, and C. It's like all of the above is, is my answer. No, one you put in the microwave, <laughs> one, one you is zip a apart. towel with armholes, and the other is basically closed with a zipper. Uh, I'm going with pajamas with the zipper. Let's watch. And towels with fasteners? I think not. Now there's the wearable towel. The towel with arm openings. The wearable towel keeps you totally covered and gives you the freedom to use your hands. Great for getting the paper. <laughs> Great for getting the paper. Hey mom, our neighbor's a caveman. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually more embarrassing to walk outside in that thing than it is to go outside naked. <laughs> I know, like, you know, just go outside naked, man. What a dummy. I'm Fred Flipstone. Just, okay. <laughs> just cause you got muscles doesn't mean you're not a dummy. All right, this next one, uh, by the way, you still only got one right. This one's oh, next, uh, next one is from the early 90s. Is talking on the phone getting out of hand? Look out! Look out! <laughs> Whoa, look at she, she with that phone. She I dropped love, it right in the bowl. I love the fact that, like, what was, what was the person saying to her? She's like, hey! Yeah. <laughs> 
Are you making are you making my favorite cake, honey? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> What's this infomercial for? Is it A, the telescarf, a fashionable scarf that holds your phone so when you drop the phone it doesn't fall too far? Or B, phone relief, a plastic headband that keeps the phone by your head via Velcro. Okay. C, the shoulder holder, a plastic cradle that rests on your shoulder so you can keep a phone in place by your head. Or D, Phone Gary, a guy named Gary who holds your phone because he's got nothing better to do. <laughs> phone Gary. <laughs> Help wanted. Name has to be Gary. Yes. Um, mm. Again, these all are so similar. I don't think the scarf is it. I think it's the shoulder holder, C. I think all it's right. just like the cradle there. Let's see it. He is talking on the phone, getting out of hand? Look out, you need phone relief. The ultimate in hands-free phone design. Watch, simply attach the special bubble back fastener to any phone, then attach the phone relief headset. It's that easy. Phone relief works with your favorite phone, an amazing breakthrough product you'll use every day. Ah, look at him knit, you can grill. That guy grilling, man. He's living <laughs> the life, man. I'd love to peek over and look at my neighbor <laughs> and see that happen. I'd be like, can I come over? Yeah. And somehow it's still cooler than a Bluetooth headset. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Okay, wow, the next muscles on one side are really gonna. You can't win now, but you know what? We're having fun. Let's... I think I've been winning the entire time. Let's, let's watch another one. Ouch. Stubbed your toe in the middle of the night? Stumbling <gasps> around in the dark is dangerous. The dark is dangerous. Okay, what is this an infomercial for? Is it A, Twilight's? Stylish glasses with built-in mini flashlights. B, angel socks. Socks with built-in safety halos meant to gently push dangerous obstacles out of the way. C, bright feet. High-tech slippers with built-in LED lights that light your path. Mm. Or D, a candle. <laughs> I mean, with proper marketing, you can sell anything. Even a candle. Uh -huh. um, see, I was thinking the bright feet concept Mm. When I heard about angel socks, because angel socks, we're not laughing about. When did you hear about angel socks? When you said it. Oh. When you said angel socks, I was thinking about bright feet. Okay. Even before you said it. So you want to go with bright feet? Uh, my answer is C, bright feet, because B can't be a thing. Okay, let's watch. Stumbling <gasps> around in the dark is dangerous. Don't turn on the light and wake up the whole family. Now there's Bright Feet, the high-tech house shoes that light up your night. Bright Feet are like personal night lights that move with you anywhere. And Bright Feet's powerful LED light softly and clearly illuminates an area up to 25 feet in front of you. Everyone loves Bright Feet. It's the latest craze sweeping the nation. I'm sure that doesn't work. Well, especially when you have to pee on one foot. <laughs> like, well, <laughs> you gotta aim. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta yeah. see where you're, where you're tinkling. I do that already. Oh. It's, like, it, like an ostrich. Like, well, like a yoga pose. Link, uh, you were right, congratulations, but you are mostly wrong. So you are going to have to enjoy some champagne from the Champagne ShamWow and Good Mythical More. Well, that seems like a prize to me. <laughs> Thanks for liking, commenting, and subscribing. You know what time it is. Hi, I'm Kent. I'm Jasmine, and, and we're, we're at High Point, North Carolina, and we're at the, the Red House. House. We're black people and white people buy, buy furniture, furniture, and it's, it's time, time to spin, spin the wheel of mythicality. <laughs> Get yourself a sofa. Awesome! Click the top link to watch us match the mythical team member to the infomercial item they purchased in Good Mythical More. And to find out where the wheel of mythicality is gonna land. The Snotebook is back, and it's more mythical than ever. Get the Mythical Snotebook now at mythical.store.